So what exactly are these agentic AI things and what is agentic AI in general? Well, it refers to systems designed to act autonomously as agents on behalf of their human users and of course other AI systems. And they make decisions and they take actions to achieve specific goals. And these are just your average AI systems. You know, it's not just like for creating images, for creating videos to, you know, have some fun with it or to just create content with it. They're actually built to initiate action, right? To cooperate, to do something more meaningful to a certain company or to a certain person or whatever. They can also learn from the outcomes and they can learn from you. That is from your needs over time. Nowadays, you can think of AI systems as digital employees. And if anyone ever tells me from now on that AI is not here to take away our jobs, I'm gonna puke. Digital AI workers, they're here. And the only thing that is good in this case is that we get another job, and that is to offer this service of training those AI workers. Because if anyone wants to have a digital worker workforce, right? Well, they have to bring them in, they have to pay for them to bring them in, and they have to train them. They have to give them a lot of data so they can know in which company they work. So for which company they're working for. You have to give them the energy via AI tokens, and you just have to welcome them in your team. And you have to get all of those workers to work together on a certain thing. So that opens up an opportunity for us to deliver the service. For example, NVIDIA is all about AI nowadays, but they're not offering the service to deliver AI. They're just there to support the ecosystem, to make all of this capable, available, whatever. But it is up to us to deliver AI agents to companies, to you know personal use, for vehicles, whatever you want. So in a nutshell, today's topic is how we can make money with agentic AI. That is, what are the ways in which we can offer ourselves to train those AI tools? And there's a lot of use cases. There's a lot of talk online. And I think that nowadays, the first thing that we see is, you know, interacting with websites, interacting with certain tasks that are online, right? So for example, there's a lot of customer support options, you know, online, such as chat base, which can make you you know, a complete chat bot. You can essentially drop service this online and there's a lot of demand for it because even your local bakery shop nowadays wants a chat bot, right? Everyone wants something streamlined, everyone wants something faster. And this is an opportunity for us to, you know, just learn to use chat base, for example, and then just offer yourself to the market. Or Manus here. Manus is a general AI agent. I'm gonna show you what it can do. It's really, really good. It's a Chinese company, once again, just like DeepSeek. And, you know, it works in a prompt style. You see here, so if you wanted to go to seven day in Japan, you want a travel plan for it, you put the budget, and on the right hand side here, you can see that it explores, right? So it goes online. It visits all of these web pages, and in the end, it's gonna give you the full report on it. Now, this is just a one minor example of what it can do, but it's really cool for me that, first of all, it has a to-do list, as you were able to see right now, and then you see it in action, right? You see it going over, visiting all these pages, and then it just spits out the final result like this one is here. So what are you gonna do on day one? What are you gonna do on day two? And for all the seven days, you know? And the prompt was, you know, we love historical sites, hidden gems, and Japanese culture. So it understands all of that, and then it goes on to do the research. And this can go for various tasks, especially for research purposes for game design, for spreadsheet designs, whatever. You can just give it a prompt, give it a task, and then just go and make yourself coffee, go on lunch, you know, and when you come back, the task is gonna be done. Now, as I've told you, you just wanna be the service provider. That is, you wanna learn 
how to use Manus, how to use Chatbase, how to use some other AI agent tools in order to, you know, just get yourself more knowledgeable how to build these things, do a lot of research online, practice a lot as well, and then just firstly offer yourself on these freelancing platforms. Secondly, you want to market yourself, right? You want to use Instagram to showcase your work. You want to use YouTube channel, TikTok, whatever you have in mind. Maybe just make yourself an own website. It depends at which level you are in now. But trust me, everything is possible now because this is a new thing. Everyone is starting from scratch. Everyone made a gig on Fiverr, I don't know, maybe three months ago. Everyone is at the starting point and everyone is learning. So everyone has an opportunity, right? This is a golden opportunity to learn how to deliver AI workers to people in need. So yeah, you can do it, but it's just gonna depend on you. Which tools you use, what kind of passion you have. Do you wanna deal with customer support? Do you wanna go with personal assistance? Do you wanna go with e-commerce, whatever? I told you, bakeries, flower shops, your local shops in the neighborhood, well, they will need something automated as well. So just reach out. But first of all, you gotta practice. Just go and see what kind of money these people charge for agents, right? Just have a look at these numbers here. It's huge because there's not a lot of people doing it. Now, you wanna scout out your competition, you wanna see what they're using, how they're using it, and then just find something which interests you just a tiny bit. Later on, when you put in the grind, when you just work on it for some time, when you practice enough, it's just gonna get easier and easier, honestly. A little more like beginner version of this is just to use chatbots, right? Of course, you're gonna get less money with these, but they're so easy to make, right? You've got Chatbase here. Chatbase is the tool to create your customer support agent, and all that Chatbase needs is the source. All it needs is the training data. You remember we were talking about how you have to train these? Well, chatbots are trained on PDF files, on websites, on YouTube videos, whatever. You just put them the source, maybe it's a PDF file from your local neighborhood shop, and then the chatbot will learn everything about it. So when next time a customer of that client, whatever, asks the chatbot about something, it'll just spit out the answer because it was trained on that data, right? So this is maybe the most beginner-friendly option to start with. Later on, you can expand, of course. And yeah, just like I've told you, everyone is at the start now. Don't believe these people that are already selling you AI agent courses. It's a start. How can you expect that someone's like an expert in a certain field, which just started a few months ago, right? So you can do it as well. You just have to sit there and you have to work on it. All right, if you have passion for it, just go for it because everyone is in the same place with AI. It just started and it has very bright future. Now, Manus here is a general AI agent, as I've told you, and you can just visit the website. It is over at manus.im and you've got these use case galleries. You can see what they were able to make with this one, but Manus you can't use yet because I think it's gonna take a few weeks in order to just open this up to the general public. It's not gonna be expensive, but right now you need an invitation code, right? So not everyone can use it, but until you, you know, watch this video or learn something about Agentic AI, well, it's gonna be available. Just have a look at this. Someone recreated Super Mario and I'm playing it right now, right? So at this very moment, I'm playing this game, which was created by Manus. It's, it's just good. And as I've told you, you know, $300 for something, $1,000 for something, and you can see that these people already have reviews, it's gonna be the perfect thing. Just firstly, go and read more about it. Go and see what kind of platforms you can use. I recommend a chat base for customer support. There's even custom GPT.ai, but this one is a little bit more expensive. And you know, you're gonna need some time or a little bit of investment to start using this one, because as you can see, it's $100 per month. But later on, when you just start getting and landing those clients, this one is gonna be really, really useful. And yeah, Manus, when it comes out to the general public, it's just gonna be perfect. I suggest you watch this video. And yeah, just like they say here, 
Agentic AI is an emerging technology that is set to transform industries everywhere, right? As I've told you, each shop, each e-commerce owner is going to get transformed with it because it's a digital workforce. People are going to love digital workers, especially the owners. They can't make mistakes once they're trained on data. They will not do the jobs that they're not supposed to do. They will not eat, they will not sleep, and they will not ask for vacation. They will not go to the doctor's office. And I know it sounds sad and it sounds like, oh, God damn, what are we getting into? But this is the future, honestly. And the only opportunity that we humans can use is to deliver these kind of services, to learn how to make specific AI agent for someone else's use case, right? So that's it in a nutshell. But you can do it because, well, whatever you set your mind to, you can do it. That's so true. So, yeah, wish you good luck. And I'll catch you in the next one.